<laughs> hey, welcome back and in today's video. Did you hear that bird outside? Where's New Mars Argo music? I, I, I just don't know. She said it was coming, but where is it? And also, I'm going to be away for a little bit, going to LA. And it's going to be a little bit spotty for me to be on my social medias or posting videos. I will be doing a live stream in LA. I'm hanging out with a bunch of uh, uh, partnered live streamers down there. Some new faces for you guys to meet. It's going to be freaking awesome. Um, but a better way to get a hold of me while I'm uh, flying around in the sky, uh, add my Snapchat, Repzilla, and also the Discord channel. Links for these are on the channel, and they're going to be in the description. Also, I heard the touch. Did Titanic Sinclair, did, did he, did he accuse somebody else of copying in the middle of a lawsuit? No way. Yeah, I did dye my hair. It is darker. Good, good eye. So over on the rips of the Twitter, I made a post. I said, Mars Argo, where is that music you promised? Is what everyone is thinking. Now, hold on. There's two sides of this story here, two sides of this battle. Um, there are people, I noticed that on Twitter when I typed in, uh, when I searched for Mars Argo, everybody was asking where that music was. They are highly anticipating this comeback. They, they've they been waiting on it for many years and they want it. And on the other end of the spectrum, there's other people that are saying, whoa, give it time. She's having a rough go. She's in the middle of a lawsuit. How can you be so selfish? So there's two arguments right there. There's people that say, we've waited too long, you said this, it kind of feels like uh, you're just kind of leading us on, and the other end of the spectrum they're saying she needs time. Um, if you want to get in on that argument, I'll leave the link to this tweet post in the description below. How do I feel about this? How do I feel about this? I honestly feel she said she's coming back, that's a big deal. We should give her some time. Be patient. I understand that you want to see this music. Uh, they're arguing about it over here, but there's something else that's better to argue about. However, on June 2nd, Pocket Size Panda said, "Yes, this is serious." Says, "Did you see this? Titanic accused an artist of ripping off a poppy song. It went about as well as you'd expect from the man who abused and ripped off Mars Argo. Makes me wonder if we'll be getting a lawsuit update soon. Somebody is clearly in a bad mood." He says, please explain at you know limbo. This is like, this was like a whole, uh, a whole thing here. Um, it's like a conversation between those two. If you're interested in that, I will put the link to this in the description below. As far as any updates to the lawsuit, there are not any as of yet. I've seen a really nice video that I'm going to link in the description from my uh, friend, the whiskey lawyer. Nick Rakita where he explained two no three possible scenarios being of which the summons needs to be served to Titanic Sinclair and Poppy and it might just not have been served yet uh, upon that serving they would be going to court there are many different reasons why the second one was that Mars Argo never intended to pursue the lawsuit and was just using this as a way to uh, revamp her career creating some uh, commotion as you will uh, I, I hate I don't think that's gonna be ahead of hate to think that and the third one being is that the lawyers from Mars Argo and Titanic Sinclair are both talking trying to work out some kind of deal all these are likely scenarios I really suggest you watch that video it's really good really insightful um, as far as me I am not gonna be doing my regular videos that's right He's going on another break, but this is a different. This is a business break. I'm going out there. I'm going to try to secure some pretty cool deals for you guys. Maybe we can have some uh, nice merch, nice uh, brand deals and sponsorships for the channel so we can give some cool stuff to you. Uh, also hanging out with some new people. It's going to be great. Any other drama with uh, Dasha and Ed's Generation and Mita Bell or really anything else, I will be updating you on Twitter. I will be doing a lot of Snapchat. You're going to want to add Repzilla on Snapchat. Other than that, that's really all I have. Uh, excited to be going out to LA. I'm excited to uh, give you the experiences that I have uh, from that. Sounds, it's going to be fun. So, 
as interesting as this is, there's always something that's more interesting than me. That's right, you guessed it. I want to know what you think. So why don't you go ahead and leave your creative and or interesting responses in the comment box below. Thumbs up for this like. And as always, brothers and sisters, I will see you in the next video. In yesterday's live stream, we met a really cool guy from Walmart. Uh, it got really uh, emotional, really motivational. I suggest that you watch that uh, live stream. I got the time codes in the comment section pinned and in the description of yesterday's video. It's pretty cool. You, you should check that out because I know that you're repping. If you're not repping, you're Greg. And how do you become a member of the Red Squad? All you got to do is subscribe with notifications turned on. Be in the comment section to every single video because I'm going to be there. Greg the Cat's going to be there. And the rest of the Rep Squad community will be there. And I expect to see you there too because this channel loves you.